What is going on guys and girls, my name is Van Gogh and today for you we have the Inform Marco Devaro player review, the Italian striker who plays in the MLS. He is 36 years of age, I believe he's about 5 foot 10 as well so he's not the tallest of strikers but that does not make any difference whatsoever because he's amazing at heading anyway. He, he We played uh, 7 games and we actually got 9 goals of him, it should have been a lot more. There was, I played against one guy and he had Buffon in net and he pulled off some absolutely amazing saves from Devaro's long shots. Uh, from his point black range heading and stuff like that. So guys, let's have a look at his in-game stats. And right now you can see there, 99 finishing. That is the standout stat. And believe me, you feel the 99 finishing. Uh, his shot power is 94. I think his long shots are 82. Now, I think that's a huge lie. They feel like they're 99, I swear to God. Every single time I took a shot outside the box, it just seemed to go in. Uh, yes, he is five foot ten. As I said, he's a striker. Italy. He has got medium attacking work rate and a medium defensive work rate. Uh, usually, players with medium attacking work rates I don't get along with, but surprisingly, it didn't bother me with Marco De Vial. Uh You can look at his physical attributes now. For a 30, thirty-six-year-old, he's actually really fast. Like his acceleration meets his sprint speed as well. So. He gets up to the speed pretty fast and he stays at that constant high speed. Uh, surprisingly, he turned out to be quite a good little playmaker. He he set up quite a few goals. He did some really influential passes as well. And I, I really wasn't expecting it. Because I think on his card, his passing stat is not one of the best stats that he owns. But if you look at passes like that, if you've got a striker that can hold the ball up and then do some through balls like this to your wingers to get it in for the cross, then... That there's nothing more you want apart from obviously every other statistic and everything else that I'm going to be talking about later on in the video. But passing wise, it was pretty immense. Heading wise as well, he's one of these players that can actually win the headers from the goal kicks, if you know what I mean. And I really like players like that. I've said it with Damjanovic, he was pretty good. Uh, Mandzukic was pretty good at it. They could just win headers above of the uh, defenders, and I really liked that. Shooting. This is where this player absolutely excels from the best. He is one of the best cards I have ever used. Look at this. Wow, I, I, I'm awful, and I mean I'm really awful at long shots, but with DeVaio, I just seem to score constantly from outside the box. He seems to take these absolutely immense shots from inside the box. He's just an awesome player. I mean, look at that. It takes around a couple of people. His dribbling is pretty good. His dribbling is clumsy but good, if you know what I mean. It's... I don't know how to explain it. It's one of these really annoying things. If you've ever used Alan or Damjanovic, they have a really clumsy like kind of touch, but it works to their advantage because it, they can take shots off the clumsy touch, if you know what I mean. It's it's really strange to explain, but I think it really does work in his, in his, can't speak, in his advantage. So, guys, you're going to see some more clips now, and... You're just going to see some pretty immense goals. I'm, I'm not even joking. This guy is one of the best guys I've ever used. I'm going to give him a straight 10 out of 10 just because for his price, I paid about 20k on him. And honestly, he should be a lot more than that. From what I experienced, every single goal I scored, every, every single pass I played, I would have definitely paid at least 60k for him. He was really, really good. He's not slow. He can dribble. He can head the ball. He can pass the ball. He can shoot. I'm trying to think of what else you want your striker to do. I mean, he's quite strong as well for quite a small man. I mean, he does shrug defenders off, and that's really good because that means he's the whole package. He reminded me of, like, I don't know, his long shots were that of Aguero's long shots. They were really, really good. So, guys, as you can see, an overall here, 10 out of 10. I'm basically just summing up what I have said in the previous three or four minutes. So go out and buy him. And if you have enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment and subscribe. If this video gets up to 50 likes today, I will upload an Inform Gamera review later. Thank you. Goodbye.